True Homeschool Academy Reading Lab presents Books I Found at the Library. I Want to Ride the Tap Tap. This book was written by Daniel Joseph with pictures by Oliver Ganthair. On Lendy morning, Claude and Man Man walked Papa to the tap tap stop. Where are you going? Claude asked the lady holding a basket. To the market to sell my mangoes. Boba guy, Claude said. Can I go to the market, Man Man? No, Claude, Man Man said. You have to go to school. Claude waved goodbye to Papa. He dreamed of mangoes. On Maddie, the tap tap rolled down the mountain. Where are you going? Claude asked the man, carrying a bucket and a pole. Fishing, the man replied. Boba guy, Claude asked Man Man. Can I catch some fish? No, Claude. It's a school day. Claude imagined reeling in a jumbo fish from Man Man's gumbo. On Mercredi, Claude played with marbles while they waited for the tap tap. Where are you going? Claude asked a woman balancing a tub of straw on her head. To make hats. Boba guy, Claude pleaded. Can I go too? Man Man sighed. Not today, Papa said. Claude wished he could weave a hat for Man Man to shade her from the sun. On Jedi, Claude spotted a man with a box of paints and a paintbrush, waiting for the tap tap. Where are you going? Claude asked. To paint a picture of the beach. Bob a guy! Claude jumped up and down. He looked at Man Man. I know, not today. Claude wanted to paint a picture of his very own tap tap. On Vendredi, a man banged on a steel drum. Ping, 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 ping. Where are you going? Claude asked. To perform with my band, the man said. Boba guy. Claude hummed to the music. Can I go see him play? Please. Not today, man man said. Claude stomped to the beat of the drum. He was missing all the fun. On Samedi, Claude woke up early. He felt sad. No tap tap, no mangoes, no fishing, no weaving, no painting, no drumming. Only chores at home. On Dimash morning after church, Papa said, let's go to the tap tap stop. Why? Claude looked up at Papa. He saw a twinkle in Papa's eye. The tap tap clanked to a halt. Welcome aboard, the driver said. Claude dashed inside. When the tap tap turned left, Claude slid right. When the tap tap turned right, Claude slid left. As the tap tap bounced up and down the street, Claude asked, Papa, where are we going? You'll see, Papa said. Finally, the tap tap stopped. Papa stood up. We're here. Claude hurried off the tap tap and ran to the beachfront. Bob a guy! Look who's here! Claude shouted. The mango lady gave Claude a mango. Merci, he said. The fisherman called to Claude. Hey, help me reel in this fish. Claude grabbed the pole and tugged hard. Would you like to make a hat? The hat lady asked. Yes, for my mother, Claude replied. The lady showed him how to weave the straw over and under over and under. The artist asked Claude, would you like to paint? Yes! Claude beamed. My very own tap tap. Well then, let's get started, Tippity. At the end of the day, Claude picked up his feet and danced to the beat of the drum. He clapped as the band played his favorite songs. Before Claude knew it, all his friends from the tap tap stop were swaying and sashaying. Papa took Man Man's hand and spun her around. Ooh la la, Claude hollered. Bon bagay. What a delightful look into Haitian and Creole culture. This book made me so nostalgic and made me remember being a little girl growing up in the Caribbean. We didn't quite have tap taps, but we had something very similar called dollar safaris. I hope you enjoyed this book. 
take a look at the pictures we drew of our very own tap taps. I hope to see you next time.